I think I like your vibe. She say the feeling's mutual, so take your time. Embrace your intuition, girl, state your mind. I'm man enough to put my pride to the side, cause I like your vibe. And what she told me, I like your vibe. What's good? You know what time it is? No, you don't know, but I do. <laughs> it is time for wash day. If you haven't been able to tell my shit looks a hot ass mess and it is time to wash it so i'm gonna go on a haul for natural hair products and see what i find get some new stuff try some new products today since the coronavirus wanna just come and pop up in our lives and have us quarantining and shit I don't have nowhere to be. I don't have nowhere to go. Work is canceled. I can try new products and not worry about how it's going to look. So we finna pull up on Target real quick. Swerve, swerve. And see what we can find. Okay? Okay? All right, all right. Okay. I know I look crazy. Ooh, Lord. Lord. Mm, mm, mm. I look tired, huh? All right. We here. I don't know exactly what I'm looking for, but we are gonna check and see what they have. How much is this? Cannabis Sativa Hemp Seed Oil Premium Blend. And they have 99% Natural Argan, Making Black Pastor. I don't know what the best ones are. They have jojoba, tea tree, coconut. I know I really like pastor oil. So I've never tried Miel products. My sister has some of their products and I've been really wanting to try them. Oh, there's Design Essentials down there, but they're really picked over. They don't really have too many options. There's so many options that I've not tried. I don't know what to start with. They have a Carol's Daughter Wash Day Delight. Love at first wash water to foam shampoo with aloe. They have the Carol's Daughter Black Vanilla Sulfate Free Shampoo. Leaving conditioner, twisting souffle, curl coil stuff, sculpting custard. So they have some Aunt Jackie's. I just saw someone post this on Twitter. Some Oso oh Clean moisturizing and softening shampoo. I'm thinking about trying that. And this Quench moisture intensive leave-in conditioner. Has anybody used this hydrating cream conditioner by Cantu? And they also have um, a cleansing cream shampoo too. I'm actually really curious. I really love these on my hair. The Argan Oil from Morocco Sulfate Free Moisture and Shine Shampoo and Conditioner. I, I used these for a while and I really did like these on my hair. The shampoo especially I loved on my hair. I'm thinking about buying it again but I don't want to go like way too far over my budget. This is cheaper though. This is only like six bucks. Just get what I have and go sis. I think I need to just get what I have and go because uh, this shit's not about to be cheap at all. I actually just had to put a few things back because I forgot that each item is like 10 to $12 because freaking natural hair care products are expensive AF. And I had like two, four, six, eight, nine. I had like 13 products. I'm about to just check really quick and make sure that I got pretty much what I want. I'm trying to stay within a certain budget. I'm not really sure if I can stay in that budget or not because this shit is not cheap. Not cheap at all. I'm dead. I'm going to go to the checkout and bring all this shit up because I know my total is going to be off the hook. Oh, and mother freaking G. So definitely um, glad that I put back all those items that I had because there was literally no way I was going to be paying $150 in hair products. Like that's just ridiculous. And I need new hair products. I need to start tr trying more stuff. My shit lasts me a long time. <sighs> it was about time I got new stuff anyway. So we're going to get home and see what I got. Woo! I'm sitting here looking at this receipt and baby, I'm pissed. I literally bought nine items, nine items for $99. That is $11 an item on average. That is ridiculous. Miel Organics is expensive AF. Their products were 13 and up. I don't know how often I'll be purchasing their products because I don't need to be spending, like, it's really not that serious. Like, you can get 
natural first of all you can go buy some goddamn avocados from the store make your own shit like you don't have to spend this much money on natural hair products but for those of us who do and who don't make our own stuff and who do spend money Miel Organics is obviously a more high-end product very expensive you don't need to spend that kind of money Cantu's little six dollar intensive care argan oil products work perfectly fine but since I wanted to be bougie and go to Target and try out some new shit this is what my ass gets right here that's what I get I am so annoyed but you know what we gonna um we gonna see we gonna see how this stuff works because I'm um, she me home let's see what I got so I for sure needed some new oil. So I got some new castor oil, the Jamaican mango and lime. This one has the vitamins A, D, and E in it. I really, really, really want to try this. 100% pure oil, cannabis sativa hemp seed oil, premium blend. I really, really, really want to try this. I've been hearing about it. Got some expensive ass meal, leave-in conditioner, pomegranate and honey. I got another expensive ass meal product, a deep condition. Their pomegranate and honey coil sculpting custard. I got some of my favorite brands, Shea Moisture, one of my favorite brands at least. The Manuka Honey and Mephora Oil Shampoo and a Conditioner, Intensive Hydration. And then I have some Aunt Jackie's Oh So Clean Moisturizing and Softening Shampoo. And then their Quench Moisture Intensive Leave-In Conditioner. Uh, last but not least, I have the As I Am Classic Leave-In Conditioner. Really, I just have the co-wash. Uh, so that will go with the co-wash. As I Am, surprisingly, was cheaper than Miel. I think I might use Miss Jack or Aunt Jackie's. I don't know which one I want to try. I really don't. Well, let's see. All right, so here is my natural hair stock. I have a lot of organics products. I have some Aunt Jackie's. I have the as i am i have some uh, shea moisture like their mask i have a coconut smoothie i have a lot of stuff i have some aussie got some shea moisture i really love this conditioner the awapui argan of morocco so that's kind of what i use right now regularly if you have any suggestions i have 3b 3c hair let me know in the comments if you guys have used any of these products what you think about them i'm super excited that i got some new stuff especially these oils i've been really needing some new oils let me know what you guys use and what the move is what's working out there for y'all subscribe like and show some love follow me on instagram at a y e y o j a z z at a o jazz and yeah stay tuned for more videos i'm gonna be dropping a lot more check your girl out stay tuned we out here making a comeback all 2020 okay thank you guys for sticking with me and i appreciate you holla at y'all later